Hello everyone! So welcome to this video. In today's video, we will try, test, and prove if affordable and drugstore makeup can really make you this beautiful. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Hello everyone! Ngayon natin patutunayan kung talagang nakakaganda ba ang drugstore at affordable makeup? Let's go! Alright, so we will start with um, this Sage Lady um, All Matte for Invisible Face Primer. Um, this is very cheap. I believe I bought this from um, Lazada for 150 pesos only. A very cheap, affordable um, face primer, but very, very good. Because it really smoothens the face. And, mura lang siya. Very affordable. So, ayan. I'm massaging it into my face. So, um, what it does is that um, it makes, ayan oh, the skin feel very tacky so hopefully yung foundation magsistick talaga siya sa ating face because of the face now for the foundation i have a dilemma because i have two drugstore foundation here one is the maybelline um fit me matte poreless fit me foundation this is um, 399 pesos. I bought this from Watson's. So this is very, very nice. Um, I use it most of the time. But I also love the L'Oreal um, True Match Super Blendable Makeup uh, Foundation. So this is around 450 to 499 pesos. This is also very, very good. Um, I also use this most of the time. So parang Silen pareho, totoo ba? <laughs> anyway, um, so which is which? I think I will use the Fit Me. Kasi ito yung parang mas marami dito sa Philippines na nakikita ko. Um, especially when I go, go to Watson's or the SM department store, and dami dami bumibili nito. So let's use this for today. Alright? So once I put on my foundation, what I will do is with the use of a beauty blender, I will blend this using ano, uh, a, a dab dabbing or padding motion para hindi natin nahihila yung foundation sa skin. So pat pat lang siya para manunot manunot siya at pumasok sa ating pores. <laughs> Ganon, kailangan punong puno yung pores ng foundation. Ganyan. So, just pat, pat. And make sure na super covered ang ating skin. So, as you can see, this is medium coverage, but this is also blendable. Um, buildable. So, yun. You can build this up. Um, if you want full coverage, you can put more. And, Dag, 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 dag lang siya hanggang parang maging cemento na if you really, really like that full coverage effect. Yung mga malo cemento na. Ayan. ba? So, once you're done with the foundation, what I will do is that I will set this with a pressed powder. I also have a dilemma because, again, I have a Maybelline New York um, Clear Smooth All-in-One UV Lightening all Oil Control 2-Way Cake. And this is around 499 pesos. And I also have the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte 16 Hour Powder Foundation, which is 499 as well. But since we use the Maybelline Fit Me, we'll use the Maybelline Press Powder as well. Para may consistency, diba? So let's use this. As you can see, I'm done putting um, the pressed powder and setting my face. 
what you've noticed is that hindi ko siya binabrush ng ganyan. What I do is that I use a patting um, style or motion para hindi madrag yung foundation away from the skin. Kasi normally, lahat tayo dikuskus ng ganyan, di ba? Nakasanayan na natin yan. But um, all you need to do is to pat it. Ganyan. Kasi para hindi tayo mukhang dinilaan ng pusa at lahat ng makeup natin ay umangat na ganon. Di ba? <laughs> so, yun. Um, now, we will move on to contouring. So, for contour, I will be using this Detail Contour Blush Palette 4-in-1. So, as you can see, nagamit ko na siya. These are for your contours, these are for your highlights, and these are for your blush. So, this is Detail. You can buy this at Watson's or um, SM Department Store. I bought this for around, I believe, $399 or $299. I can't remember anymore, pero ganun lang ang price point niya. So, with a contouring blush, contouring brush, <laughs> we will be dipping into these two para magka-contour tayo. Contour, contour, and then bronze, bronze. Ganyan. So, we're done with the contour. Ayan, contour na contour na tayo. Um, it looks, it looks, <laughs> it looks um, harsh right now, pero hindi. Once I set my face, once I add more um, powder to that, magtutone down siya. Tsaka okay na rin yan, para mukhang chiseled na chiseled, payat na payat, pitit na pitit ang ating face. So, um, before I put on my um, eyeshadow, I normally do my kilay because Gusto ko naka-frame na yung kilay bago pa man ako maglagay ng eyeshadow. Para yun ang sinusundan ko. Kanya-kanyang, ano lang yan, discard. Um, do what works for you. And ako, mas gusto kong inuuna yung kilay. Now for the kilay, I don't have any pang kilay na from um, the affordable brands or the drugstore brand. Um, wala akong powder na pang kilay. So, what I have is an eyeliner from Chihuahua Makeup. <laughs> yes, Chihuahua, as in the aso. Um, nung bago-bago pa to, may drawing to ng aso somewhere. So, the Chihuahua brand, I saw this at Glorietta 4, um, near the office. I was walking around, I saw that there's a makeup there. And during that time, I have to go to an event and I don't have my eyeliner with me. So I bought this, and this is for 100, 100 pesos, 99 pesos. So I bought this because kailangan ko ng eyeliner during that time. And so I will be using this one para sa ating kilay. So ayan, once I've done shaping my eyebrows and filling up the gaps, <laughs> I will be using this Fashion 21 gel, um, eyebrow gel. This is smudge proof and it's in color light brown. Um, I normally use this sa kilay para uh, magkaroon siya ng bushy bushy effect which I really really love. And aside from that, para mag tone down yung dark color ng eyeshadow. Uh, ng ating kilay. So, I think I bought this for around 150 or 199 I'm not sure. But this is Fashion 21. Alam naman natin, ang Fashion 21, very affordable. Um, I would say that this is my go-to um, brand when I was still in college. Because you know naman, in college, very minimal ang ating baon. I think I only have 70 pesos as a baon when I was still in college. So, this is the only thing that I can afford back then. So I really have to make it feed my baon to buy makeup from Fashion 21 or if not, Careline. <laughs> Those are the days. Nakakamiss. Anyway, let's put this in our eyebrows. Alright, so we're done with the kilay. I have another dilemma. I don't have um, a drugstore or an affordable eyeshadow. I don't know why. I know for a fact that I do have a Maybelline. And I think a cover girl eyeshadow. I've been looking for it. I 
ko makita. So, ewan ko kung may nagmating <laughs> or napamigay ko na yata. I don't know. So, that's my dilemma. Um, I'm very much willing to try um, a drugstore or an affordable eyeshadow. So, if you have any suggestions on what do you think is the best um, drugstore eyeshadow palette, um, please comment it down below. I will try that. Um, your suggestions and recommendations are highly appreciated. So there you go. But since we don't have that right now, I will make do of what we have. I will go back to the contour palette and try this as a nice shadow. I don't know what's gonna happen. Let's see. I'm so, so scared. But what the heck. Let's try it out. Let's go. Ayan, pinagsagaan natin yung contour palette for the eyeshadow and I think it works naman. What I will do next is to put my liquid eyeliner, yung ating tungkil, using Color Mate's um, liquid eyeliner. This is something that I got from my mom. She bought it in the US and this is for $1. So, 53 pesos, 52 pesos, napakamura. So, let's do the tungkil. So there you go, we're done with the tungkil and since it's only 50 pesos or $1, what do you expect? Ang hirap niyang kontrolin, the tip is so thick and so tigas, ang hirap kontrolin, so hindi ko makreate yung perfect tungkil wing tip liner. But anyway, let's put our lower line using the brown color from the contour palette. Ayan. Again, we're using the contour palette kasi wala tayong eyeshadow. So, mag-recommend na kayo ng eyeshadow na you think is very, very good. So, we have two mascara. Uh, the first one is the Maybelline Great Lash Waterproof Mascara and I've been using this for the longest time kasi sobrang ganda niya. Sabi ko nga, uh, pag nilagay mo to, it's so makapal uh, and aside from that, super long lasting. Naghilamos ka na, natulog ka na, gumisik ka na kayo na bukasan, meron pa din. So I'm not sure if that is a good thing or a bad thing, pero yun nga, ganun siya ka-powerful. Super powerful. And then, we have this one, which is the CoverGirl Lash Exact. I think we're gonna try this one. Alright? So, we're done with the mascara. Uh, what I would do now is to add a little blush to the face using still the detail uh, contour palette. We're using the blush here. Contour. Ayan. I-brush lang natin siya sa apples ng ating cheeks. Ganyan. Para sa mapulang, mapulang piece niya. Kanti sa noo. Kanti sa baba. And now, for um, the best part, which I really, really love, ang pang-contour ng ating ilong. Let's go! So, we're done with the nose line. Ayan. How do you like it, guys? Naglagay na rin tayo ng konting shimmer and highlighter over there using, again, the detail um, contour palette. This is a very, very nice highlighter, guys. Sobrang ganda, as you can see. Alright? So, to complete my look, um, last step natin is for the lipstick. And I have a few... Um, drugstore lipstick or affordable lipstick here. Let's start with the Vice Cosmetics. This is Good Vibes. Ayan. Uh, medyo, ano siya, on the light um, pinkish shade. Uh, no, 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 no. Sorry. Hindi pala siya light. Dark pink shade na may pagka maroon. And then I have um, the Maybelline Touch of Spice. Ito, medyo may pagka nude to na merong pinkish undertone. 
I also have a Maybelline new um, vibrant violet. Parang hindi natin ito gagamitin kasi it's a very vibrant violet. Nakakaloka. I don't know kung bakit ko siya binili. I was attracted to the color at first. I've used this twice or thrice and after that, I realized that I have to check my lipstick and see if it's, you know, if I could come for somebody. <laughs> Sabi nga ni Naomi Campbell, check your lipstick before you come for me. And then I have three L'Oreal um, lipstick. This one is 242. Ayan. So this is an another matte with um, a pinkish undertone. Nagiling ako sa, ano eh, sa nude. Um, this one is super nude. And this one, and uh, that's 248. So nude na may pagka brownish. And this one is Brick Planet 298. So ayan. I think we're gonna use the Brick Planet. Let's try this one out. There you go. We're done with the lipstick. I'll just put on some NYX Matte Finish Fini Matte Setting Spray. And I will show you the finished product. <laughs> Let's go. So this is the finished product using all drugstore and affordable makeup. So, anong hatol ng bayan? Nakakaganda ba? Ang drugstore makeup, ang affordable makeup. Well, again, it's not about um, the price point of the makeup. Nasa ano yan eh? um, The quality, and of course, how you use it, and what really works for you. For some faces like mine, okay naman ang mumurahin at affordable makeup. It's really how you apply it and how you own it, di ba? So ayan, I hope you like this video. Um, if you did, please give it a thumbs up, click the like button below, and before you leave, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, The Diary of a Social Climber. Happy social climbing, everyone! Blah, blah, blah. Bye! <laughs> so this is the final look, everyone. I hope you're liking it. All drugstore makeup, full face of it. So there you go. Again, subscribe to my YouTube channel, The Diary of a Social Climber. And join me on my next video and future adventures. Happy social climbing, everyone. Bye-bye.